Jason Statham's popular heist movie The Bank Job has a brilliant yet unsuspecting cameo. The Bank Job remains one of Jason Statham's highest-rated movies of his illustrious film career with a Rotten Tomatoes critic score of 80% and an equally impressive audience score of 74%. Released in 2008, The Bank Job sees Statham's Terry Leather as the protagonist, an ordinary car dealer in London who gets the opportunity of a lifetime to steal a massive fortune from an unalarmed bank. The Bank Job was directed by Roger Donaldson, No Way Out, The Bounty, and based on a screenplay by Dick Clement and Ian LaFrenet's Across the Universe. The film earned a worldwide box office total of $61.1 million against a production budget of $20 million and is considered one of the most notable heist movies of the 21st century. Statham starred in Snatch, 2000, The Transporter, 2002, The Italian Job, 2003, and Crank, 2006, before starring in The Bank Job. Mick Jagger plays a bank employee in Jason Statham's The Bank Job. He is nearly recognizable in the brief cameo. The Bank Job has an impressive cast led by Statham, Saffron Burroughs, Stephen Campbell-Moore, Daniel Mays, and James Faulkner. The most surprising appearance in The Bank Job, however, is none other than Mick Jagger, the internationally famous lead singer of the legendary British rock band The Rolling Stones. Jagger, now 81 years old, plays a bank employee in The Bank Job with large glasses and flat brown hair, which makes him nearly unrecognizable compared to his usual rock and roll look. It was almost as if director Roger Donaldson was trying to hide Jagger's cameo in the bank job, considering his heavily layered costume and momentary screen time. Although Jagger was originally uncredited in the bank job and caused many years of online confusion and speculation on the internet, he is officially included in the cast list on IMDb. Up until 2019, the Bank Job was the most recent film that Jagger had appeared in before he starred alongside Elizabeth Debicki and Donald Sutherland in the mystery thriller The Burnt Orange Heresy. Mick Jagger's movie history explained. Jagger has appeared in a total of 10 feature films. Mick Jagger in Free Jack. Jagger made his first feature film appearance as the titular protagonist in 1970's Ned Kelly, a true crime biopic written and directed by Tony Richardson, A Taste of Honey, The Loneliness of the Long Distance Runner. He also starred in the 1970 movie performance alongside James Cox as a jaded rock star named Turner. He played himself in 1978's All You Need Is Cash and a fictional version of himself in 1987's Running Out of Luck. His only other cinematic acting roles were in the films Free Jack, 1992, Bent, 1997, Enigma, 2001, and The Man from Elysian Fields, 2001, before his inconspicuous cameo in The Bank Job.